What's going on, guys? So how long will GTA 5 Online actually last when GTA 6 finally drops? Let me know what you guys think in the comments. So personally, I think that GTA 5 will last into some of the GTA 6 release, specifically because, well, and this is saying if they release it the same way they did GTA 5. If they were to release the story mode and online at the same time, then GTA 5 Online is going to be struggling, I can tell you that. Now, not everybody is going to be able to afford the game or is going to ever probably have this game or GTA 6. So, will it completely kill, will it completely kill GTA 5 Online? At some point, probably yes. And at some point, the servers probably won't be available anymore. But I think that's going to be a long ways away. There's still going to be, you know, probably thousands of players playing on GTA 5 Online. At the same time, there will be GTA 6. But again, if they release it a month after, then it's going to be the same. I just hope that Rockstar takes notes from the last release that happened. Literally, at this point, it's going to be over 11 years. I mean, if, if things are still not right at that point, then, I mean, you can kind of do the, uh, the figuring on that, on how the, how the servers are going to be acting, how the game's going to be treated. I mean, and I talk about this all the time on my videos, and a lot of people don't seem to talk about this besides me for some reason, and I honestly don't understand it. I mean, people are so worried about the Oppressor Mark II and complaining about that instead of worrying about the real problem, which is like God Mode and God Mode Vans and Jets and all the other abusing uh, glitches or exploits, whatever you want to call it, man. But I'm hoping that Rockstar actually does the right thing and keeps the game intact this time, you know what I mean? Because this last go around man was a total disaster i mean like i said you couldn't even play two minutes into a lobby you got lucky if you even got loaded into a lobby you know uh, rockstar knows what they're doing rockstar can keep a good game and a good community obviously because look how long we've been playing gta 5 <laughs> you know by the time gta 6 drops out it'll be 11 past 11 years maybe even 11 and a half years i mean that's actually crazy i actually speculate the GTA 6 will probably come out later in the year of 2025. I feel like there's going to be a pushback, delay, whatever you want to call it, and we're going to see a big, a big difference. Because, I mean, they're saying 2025. They didn't even say when. I mean, that could be in March. That could be in August. That could be in September. So I'm thinking if it's not in the first few months of 2025, or if they don't say anything, they're going to wait until the end of the year to do it. So you might as well say there's another two years before it drops out, because at that point, if it comes out in September, we'll already be pushing it into 2026. So, there's a lot of speculation. There's a lot of uh, opinions, and just a lot of people wondering what's going to happen. You know what I mean? Um, but like I said, I don't think it will completely get rid of GTA 5 at first, but I mean, obviously, there's not going to be as many people playing as there is now on this when the online comes out now the story mode there's gonna be a lot of people playing that too but i don't think story mode is really as popular i mean people are gonna grab the content as much as they can you know what i mean clickbait it whatever you know but we're just gonna have to wait and see i i believe that rockstar can do something good i mean the trailer was nice we're gonna end up having a second trailer at some point they said trailer one on the first one so we'll have to wait and see what the second one holds for us and I don't know, maybe they'll give us more release details. Um, there's really no telling, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's all about waiting, it's all about guessing. So, again, let me know what you guys think in the comments, man. And uh, do me a favor, hit that like button, I'd appreciate it. If you're new, hit that sub button, turn on post notifications. If you guys enjoyed this video, and you guys have a good one. Peace.